A local teacher is taking students outside the classroom for a hands-on lesson to help them feed their bodies and their brains. Yeah, News 6's Julie Broughton shows us how she is using a garden to get results in our schools. We have snapdragons everywhere. Right in College Park. And it's gorgeous. Look at all the different colors. This is the same plant. Isn't it gorgeous? 2,000 square feet of lush vegetation at Lake Silver Elementary School. Okay. It's bush gardens. <laughs> I like it. For more than 25 years, this has been Pat Bush's labor of love. So this is more than a garden. Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, yes. <laughs> it is something that I absolutely love to do. Bush is a paraprofessional in the physical education department. And her specialty is teaching these young students how things grow and where food comes from. It's difficult to grow food, especially in Florida, okay? And they get an idea by just passing through, like kindergarten comes through at least two or three mm -hmm. times. Just by looking, they're learning. We go through the whole body and show that what you eat determines how your body will um, grow, it will react, um, if you're going to get old or not, you know, how big you're going to get. Bush says if students harvest it, they get to take it home. Those are nasturtiums, uh, you can eat those, the whole thing. Any excess is sold to families and staff with all money going back in to support the garden. Everything here is 95% organic. Um, this is celery, this is French celery, it's not as sharp as um, uh, American mm -hmm. celery would be. And again, we grew it from seed. The peppers from seed. Everything's from seed. Uh, I think it's just peaceful and calm because it's just super fun and Why? I feel happy out here. Uh, Mrs. Bush is very nice and she's probably the best gardening teacher ever. The cool weather growing season has just wrapped up and students are putting the garden to bed with cardboard and leaves to attract earthworms, making the soil ready for new seeds in August. Julie Broughton, Getting Results, News 6.